What's up guys, my name is Coach Manzo and you're watching All Things Basketball TV. In today's episode, I'll be going over how to improve your ball control in just four minutes. Wow. Now if you enjoy these types of videos, then do not forget to smash that like button so you can support the channel and I could keep releasing content. And if you are new to the All Things Basketball TV family, then do not forget to subscribe so that you could get free tips, tricks, drills, and advice by a basketball coach and basketball trainer. Did I mention it's free? So without further ado, let's get right into it. All right, guys, so the first drill I call single leg reverse wraps, and you're going to do 30 seconds on each leg. The reason why I call them single leg reverse wraps is because you're wrapping the ball around the leg that is on ball side. And while a traditional wrap is done behind the back, this wrap is done around the front. That's why I call it reverse wraps. The only key tip I have here is to keep your feet in place and planted at all times. Do not pick up your feet and try to keep them as still as possible. Because the point of all the drills I'll be showing you today is to improve your ball control. Thus each drill is meant to put you in an uncomfortable dribbling stance. So do not cheat by moving your feet. The second drill I have here is called V dribbles and you are to do these for a minute. To do a V dribble, you need to start off in a square stance and then dribble through the legs, catch the ball with the same hand to dribble it back through, then catch it with the opposite hand to repeat the process. Once again, you are dribbling through the legs, then catch the ball with the same hand that you used to dribble through to then dribble back through, and then catch the ball with the opposite hand and then repeat the same process. The third drill I call single leg crossbody reverse wraps. And you're to do these for 30 seconds each leg. Now these are the same exact thing as the single leg reverse wraps. However, you are wrapping the ball around the opposite leg, not the leg that's on ball side. thus forcing you to reach across your body. I know in the video I cheat a little bit by moving my feet and that's because I am retired and I am very rusty, but if you really want to get the most out of this, then you must keep your feet completely planted. Once you finish with those, then move over to the final drill, which is single arm V dribbles. And you're to do these for 30 seconds each arm. The ball pattern for these is the same as the normal V dribbles because the ball is still moving in a V pattern. However, the twist with this one is that you're doing it with one arm. Thus, you have to twist your body and reach to grab the ball when it goes through your legs. Once you complete those, you have finished the four minute circuit. And if you do this series consistently, you will see great improvements in your ball control. So that's a wrap for today's episode. If you enjoyed, then please smash that like button so you can support the channel and share this video with a friend. I cannot express enough how much that supports the channel. Once again, I'm Coach Manzo and you've been watching All Things Basketball TV.